did a long traversy pitch, which Tama had a lot of fun cleaning. It's her uh, first time cleaning something like that, so it's pretty difficult. Uh, it's been harder than I imagined. One of the traverse things is just like totally greasy, like these huge slopers. And they're kind of good to hold, but they were just slipping and slipping, and I had to do a take. Pitch after I um, aided so that Tama could clean it easily, and then I wrapped down later and I'll try it. And then the next pitch I decided to try and climb and it was just wet, just falling again and again. Smashed my shins on, a, on an overhang, it was a real pain. Um, but at the top of that pitch now, set up, gonna make a sweet bivvy. And Tama's just below me coming up, she's just gonna finish her Juma. I'm way less of a scaredy cat than I used to be, that's for sure. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just gonna get the bivvy Good effort. Yeah. <laughs> What do you think of our new bivvy spot? Better than that last spot we were at. Yeah. Oh, the hanging below was painful. Don't oh say gosh. I don't take you anywhere nice. Ooh! <laughs> two star bivvy spot. <laughs> I don't see a five star one. It's on top. <laughs> it's on top. Yes. We're on our way. <laughs> When I juma, I use foot stirrups already made on the jumas, one slightly shorter than the other. And then the patent pending elastic means they never fall off. It makes such a difference. Hear okay, that sound? That's the sound of someone put up a port ledge. Always like a cowbell. Cowbell <laughs> on the big wall. So this is the porter ledge. Sleeps two people really comfortably. It's a dream. Like, you can just camp anywhere. They're not always the easiest things to put up. There's a bit of a knack to it. Especially on a hanging belay, it's even harder. So, so far it's been going okay. It's probably the best way to say it. The crux pitch was completely wet. Um, and there's like three holds on it, it makes it really hard to do. But basically did all the other moves. Sent the first pitch. Um, the pitch after that, um, it's like this big slopey traverse and everything was so greasy. Um, so, I don't know, I had to do a take in it, so I didn't send that. I'm going to wrap it in tomorrow and do the fifth and sixth pitches. Um, one of them was wet, I just took a massive fall today as well, getting out of that. Um, and here we are, we're just underneath the big roof. Uh, there's some steep, steep climbing up there to do. Um, I'm kind of looking forward to it. We put the fly up just partly because um, I bought a fly. Um, <laughs> but it's meant to have like some kind of rain potential coming in. Um, we probably wouldn't get wet unless the rain was so high because it's so so steep and overhanging here. Um, but it, and otherwise it's kind of a big faff. But it does make it kind of homely inside, which is quite nice. You see, inside, all of our stuff lined up. Here's a tanner less terrified today. <laughs> yeah. She did good today. She did really good at some difficult like cleaning work she had to do um, and she kind of did it without too many problems. But the most amazing thing right now you have to see is this freaking epic sunset. Look at that. Now that is a big wool bivy view you cannot beat. How's it going Tama? It's good. Just chilling on the port ledge. I think today went better than yesterday though. Second day in, you're a pro now. Second day in, I'm a pro. Big pro, pro big waller. Yeah. Been climbing for one year. Two more in. <laughs> done a, right? Done a lot of. About uh, time I got on a big wall. You've done a lot of serious sport climbing, top rope in. Woo! Two I'm moldy serious. pitches. Top or three moldy pitches. Three oh, moldy no, pitches. No, more than that. How many? Four. <laughs> yeah, <maybe> four. <laughs> so it's probably, probably about time you got on a big wall. I know. Yeah. Yeah, about time. Here we are. Sending it. Sending it. In a manner of speaking. Jumaring all day. It's been pretty much the worst. I feel really good when we stop. Um, man, it's every second is exhausting. Like, even when you're belaying, there's two ropes and you're like hanging belay, your legs are going numb in your harness. Oh, and then you have to pee. Oh, that's gonna be 25 minutes, hold on. And then, 
oh, it's just so much work to do every single thing. But the view is really great. And there's nothing quite like it. And it's kind of like other things when you have to work really hard. You just, you have this like glow at the end of the day. You like runner's high for big wallers. Except for like some of the day you're just terrified and like, am I about to kill us? No, I'm not about to kill us. Why are we putting this tent in the air? Okay, everything's fine. I'm hooked to the wall. It's fine. So, what did we just have for dinner? Um, some kind of lentils, Indian lentils, and... Of course, only Indian food on this big wall. That's all we brought. It's always good when you have to poop into a little bag. <gasps> yeah, and we really thought about that. What are those? Bean, bean bread threads. Mm. as noodles. They're not that bad. No, uh, they're just kind of clear noodles, a little chewy. Nice. Mm. They cook really fast. They cook super fast. Just bring it to boil, let them sit. It's a bit like couscous, but actually better than couscous, oh. I would say. I don't oh. like couscous that much, but it's, it's just super easy. Story. <laughs> yes, team bean thread. <laughs> but bean thread and lentils, and then I just chop in lots of cheese and salami, and then it makes it a meal. Got the most expensive English breakfast tea bags. These ones cost about 50 cents each. Just boiling up a brew in the jet boil. Ooh, Tamara's taking off the helmet. Oh Looking my god. Good now. Taking risks. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Oh, I have a clean. What kind of luxury life can I have? I have clean pants. Oh, I even have a clean bandana. Oh, I'm so smart. It's not even cold. I don't even need my bedtime socks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just mumbling to myself. <laughs> now I'm talking to you, actually. She's got things she can just put her around with all day. <laughs> She's like, ooh, things. I can organize and play with them and then mutter about them. Put them up, pick them up, put them down, put them up, put them down. <laughs> Endless fun. That's true, at least. <laughs> like, these things smell so good compared to us. <laughs> everything in here smells bad compared to everything in this bed.